What is up Madden 25 gamers welcome to my YouTube channel today's video is going to be one of the last couple of videos we do to wrap up this 4-3 under defense. Um, if you guys haven't seen the previous videos you can check out uh, the latest video in the annotation above to the top left corner of your screen. Other than that guys, uh, oh also check out this other video I have uh, it should be at the top right it's a two man edge blitz. Uh, and it's pretty decent. I, I think it's one of the better blitzes in the game. So I feel like it would be uh, a benefit to you to check it out. But today's video uh, is going to showcase a nice third and long play that I like to use to send passive pressure but have really good coverage. And um, it just it, it's really good, especially for like a team like the Bengals or, or something like that. And what we want to do for this specific play, so we might make a package or something. This is just a situational uh, substitution. But we want to stack our best blitzers on the right side of the screen. So for the Bengals, that is going to be Michael Johnson and Carlos Dunlap. Some would say Jerome Harrison, but or James Harrison, but he's better served on the right-hand side in coverage. So therefore, we're going to use Michael Johnson. The play we're going to be using to get this kind of two-man passive pressure blitz is the Sam Blitz 2. You could also use the Slant Crash Left, but I like the Sam, Blast two, Sam Blitz 2 uh, just for uh, better coverage in my opinion. So here we go. We're going to set this up. This is very simple to set up, um, but it's also vulnerable in some areas. And so we're going to make it less vulnerable. And we're going to show you how to do that in a moment. But the way we want to set this play up to start out is we want to take Harrison. We want to put him into a man coverage assignment on uh, Alshon Jeffrey here, the far left receiver on the left side of the screen. We then want to put this defensive tackle still here. We want to put him in a man coverage assignment on the left of screen slot receiver Bennett. We then want to put the right of screen defensive tackle into those guys up on the slots. We want to go through and we want to put that right of screen corner into a corner into a hook zone. We want to use the YY cushion coverage, so YY. And then we're going to use our control ray and we're going to put him right back into that deep hook zone. Almost as if he was in a deep blue. We can come down if we need to, but this is just a very good passive edge rush. I wanted to share this rush with you uh, just to kind of show you what I've been doing uh, on third down. Now, if they're in like a trip set to the right, then you might consider just running like, um, you know, a cover three buzz. Or you could even just run uh, this play stock and do this, the flip version of it to the right side of the field. But it does not, the pressure is not as good, but it is very, it's still fairly decent. Um, but again, it's just not as good as the right edge. So anyways, guys, that's what I wanted to share with you guys today. Thank you for watching. I, I apologize for the shortness of this video. But again, um, this is just kind of a, a situational play. The next two videos are going to be rather short to kind of wrap this up. And then we're going to have a gameplay. So thank you for your time today, guys. And we're going to be uh, back talking specifics tomorrow about this fourth gunner defense. Also, subscribe for more of this content if you enjoyed it. I'm going to have a lot of defensive and offensive schemes coming out soon. Thank you for your time today, guys. I hope you guys have a great evening, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.